Hello, good morning, folks. So there's one more place in Luang Prabang that I need to show you. Uh, if you're into nature, a little bit of waterfall and seasonal flowers, then you should definitely consider check this out. It's not far, it's only 13 kilometers away on the other side of the Mekong River. I've been there a few times and I loved it. I mean, different season has different flowers and uh, especially during the rainy season, it has, you know, the waterfall is quite big. So today, my friends and I, we're gonna go there on a mountain bike and it should take about one hour or one hour, 20 minutes or something. Uh, like I said, it's on the other side of the Mekong River. So first of all, we have to take the ferry cross over there and then cycle all the way up to that place. Uh, I'll tell you the name later. So yeah, let's check that out and see if you like it. Okay, first of all, let me just get a hat. So hot. Let me try this on. Yo, it's about the... Mmm, honey. Okay, you're welcome. Oh, no, this is a little bit too army <laughs> military. So let me just try this. I kind of like this one. Let's see if it fits me. Mm, yeah. yeah. This color fits me well. Ani an tarai ni? Oh, ni persi pan. Persi pan. Kau sayu lagi. So this shop is sport wear. They have all sneakers and gyms stuff. Well, this would help. No, okay. <laughs> We paid 5,000 kV for the bike. Um, motorbike is 10,000. If you do the trip, this trip uh, to the park, it's better to combine it with the uh, pottery village because they're close by. It's quite interesting to see it. Yeah, this is a little market just close by to the pier so every time when uh, people are heading to their village or their hometown like on this truck as you see here they'll stop here and get some gift or some snack for their family
like I said, uh, if you go to the park, it's better to combine it with the pottery village. And this is the name of the village. It's called Banjan Nua. So as you can see, the arrow is pointing on the left hand. So instead of go straight, you just take on the left there to the pottery village. Uh, it takes a few minutes from the pier. Hello. Okay, we are now officially in the center of the district of Jampet. So Jampet is one of the 12 districts in Long Prabang province and we are right at the roundabout right in the center. So as you can see here, all these buildings surrounding us are the government's building and the Sister Women's Association. The other one is the, yeah, Ministry of something there. And what surprised me is that this district is the closest to Long Prabang city and it's the, the least developed uh, member district of Luang Prabang province and yeah it's kind of surprised me in a lot of ways it's so empty it's nothing Empty. Very empty. Two of them are here, so we call it Maxim. It's very, very sour, like full of vitamin C, and it's very, um, so you see, lots of uh, glue. So you have to take all the glue out before you eat it, and it's the best to eat it with salt and a little bit of chili powder. So I got two here. <sighs> this is the season. Okay, let's get some wild vegetable. 
or papaya salad later. So before we get to the flower park, we decided to have some lunch first. So we ordered some food at this restaurant. <laughs> so we're ordering papaya salad, omelette, and fried vegetables. And with some bit of food we brought from town. What are we having guys? <laughs> oh, you're having those? Mm -hmm. The one that we got on the road. It's very sour. Okay, now I'm gonna show you how to eat this one. It's very, very sour and it's perfect for vitamin C. So first of all, you're gonna need some salt and mix with a little bit of MSG or a chili powder, whatever you prefer. And it looks like that. You just dip it in. Mm. Ooh, very sour and also very chewy as well. It tastes a little bit like green mango. Mm. Loving it. And this is the vegetable that I collected mm -hmm. on the way. It is good to eat it with the papaya salad. And you just dip it like this. And then just... Somebody's having his straight noodle. He loves it. Do you like noodles? I think you do, right? ไม่ได้ลิ้นอะไรไปบางส่วนกันแหละบางบาร์บาร์บาร์บาร์บาร์บาร์บาร์บาร์บาร์บาร์บาร์บาร์บาร์บาร์บาร์บาร์บาร์
so that's the way to the flower garden and that's the way to the cafe and also where to where the zip lining is and to the waterfall let's walk up to the waterfall first it's 250,000 k per person that's about $15 and then uh, different activities different price Look, quite scary up there. Yeah, let's go up here. Okay, so this is the pool. Wow. Wow, uh, look at look at the color. It's like emerald. I saw some fish there. Nice. Not too bad during the dry season. Check out the flower garden. It's interesting, nice tunnel. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> can I can I shake your hand? Sorry. <laughs> I didn't bring the banana. I think you need some banana, right? Looks like you do. Okay, let me go get banana. Okay, wait for me here. See you. They have a very nice home. Hello. <laughs> Such adorable. Bye bye, Di. Bye bye, Di. How are you? 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 Yeah, got one for my babies. Okay. <laughs> there you go. That's for you. Slow, slow. <laughs> No, 
have you eat it first and then I'll give you another one. There you go. Come on. Is it a boy or a girl? It's a girl. Sorry, I'm done. Oh, that's very strong. Mm -mm, nope, nope. I cut the last one who wants this. No, you finish that first. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> You're beautiful bees. <laughs> uh -uh, you drop one. You drop one. There you go. <laughs> so nice to be in nature again. It's very quiet here. Wow. <laughs> and welcome to Green Jungle Park. So this is the flower garden. Like I said, different season has different flower, I think. Now it is French Marigold season. As you can see here, wow. Aren't they beautiful? And this is cabbage. Hey, you're having rest? Aww. Oops. Wow, many and many of them. You guys got beautiful house. Can I come stay with you? Can I? I love the house. Uh, this is the star of the park. Hello, you're a big boy. Green Jungle Park. Rainbow umbrellas. Oh wow, look at these flowers. Different colors.
still very hard. I think I'm going to go up to the viewpoint and see how it looks like. up here. Oh, they also have bungalows and um, camping ground. Nice. Let me ask them how much it costs for our camping. Well, it's a good place to get away for a weekend, I think. Wow. I like this. Huh. Didn't know they have it. Last time when I was here, I don't think they had it. Let's have a look at the bungalow house. Unless you reserve the entire camp, do not party or make noise around it after 10 p.m. That makes sense. I mean, you're in complete nature. Why should you do party here? <laughs> Let's see what's inside. Wow. Oh, look. I love this. They have pool. <gasps> Woo! And it looks so empty. Quiet. Anybody here at all? Let's see what's out there. Uh, it's just another restaurant, the way out. Oh, it's good to know that they have something like this. Alright, so I asked the reception, the tent is 350,000k per night and the room is 480,000 uh, and you can use the pool as well and that also includes breakfast. Mm -hmm. 